Hi guys, in this step-by-step -step video, I'm going to be showing you how you can import Shopify products from one store to another, okay? Now, if you have like, for example, uh, more, a lot of products on your Shopify store and you created a new Shopify store and you want to import all your products to the new Shopify store, probably you want to delete the old one or you want to, to import products from another Shopify store, it could not, like, it's not your Shopify store, but you want to import products from that Shopify store. Uh, I'm going to be showing you how you can do that at the end of this video, but at first I'm going to show you guys how you can import your own product from your Shopify store to another Shopify store. Now this will make sense in a few seconds. So as you can see, oh, I'm sorry, now what you guys need to do, first you want to go to the store that you want, like uh, I'm going to, for example, to LOL, LOL store, okay? This LOL store is the the store that I want to, like, I want to import products from my store to LOL store, as you can see here, my, my store to LOL store. Now, LOL store is a new store, but my store is an old store, okay? So I just named these uh, so that I can show you guys how you can import products. Now, first, I'm going to delete these products so that I can show you guys how you can um, start from scratch. All right. Now, as you can see, this is the store I want to import products to. So I'm going to go now to my store. Okay. Now, you want to click on products. Let's say you have like 4,000 products and you want all to import these products to your own Shopify store, to your new Shopify store. Now what you guys need to do, you want to click here, it says select and you want to select all the products. Okay. It, always, it will only select products that are in the page. Okay. So make sure you select all products. As you can see, it says here three selected. If you have like 1000 products, it will say here 1000 selected. So after that, you want to click where it says here, or it says, um, like, uh, I'm sorry, you want it to say where it says here, export, okay, here, click with, after you select, click on uh, export, and you want to select where it says, um, select three products, okay, which products I have selected, if you want, you can select all products if you want, okay. Now I'm going to select, for example, all products, okay? And then you want to click on export products. And this, as you can see at the bottom, it will say your export will be emailed to your, uh, the products will be like, they will be sent to your email. Okay, so what you guys need to do, you want to go to your own email. And as you can see, this is the email. Click here. Click here where it says downloads, click on products, export, click on that. And as you can see, it will be downloaded. The file will be downloaded. As you can see, this is the file, okay? This is it. Now, what you guys need to do, you wanna go to your own Shopify store, okay? Sorry. Go to your own Shopify store. And I'm going to go to my LUL um, store that I want to import products. So as you can see, Lul Store doesn't have any products. Um, it doesn't even have one product. Now what you guys need to do, if, you, if this is your first time importing products to that store, you will find here import. But if it's the second time, you'll find something like import somewhere here. Click on import and then click on add file and make sure you click on the file that you have downloaded and then click on upload and preview and then click on import products and all these products will be imported to this store as you can see here as you can see all the products has been successfully imported to the Shopify store I just created a few seconds ago so if you want to import products, let's say from another Shopify store, it could be your competitor, you want to import products from them, 
then what you need to do guys you want to drop a like on this video and click the video on the screen and it will show you exactly how you can import products from other stores to your own shopify store so hopefully this video guys helped you if it does leave a like subscribe to the channel see you guys in the next video if you have any questions let me know in the comments i reply to every single comment see you guys next video